Okay, welcome to Matinee's Racing, and this is the latest video. We're going to do another one-lap shootout, and this time we are going to do this around the Monza Grand Prix circuit, which is absolutely fantastic. Okay, so we're coming into the first chicane here on this warm-up lap. We have a 12-car race uh, full of Mercedes A45 AMGs, and uh, yeah, we're just now going to get the tires and brakes warmed up here. Now, don't forget that Matinee's Racing is also on social media as well. Uh, it's a, we're on Telegram, TikTok and Instagram and Twitter. So Telegram, TikTok and Instagram, it is at Matinee's Racing. And if you're on Twitter, it is at one mats racing okay so we're now warming up the tires and the the temperatures are rapidly uh, good coming down in the tires so we're just gonna have to weave like crazy uh, to still maintain tire temperature okay so we're gonna try and uh, get some distance so this is one of my favorite circuits and of course it is home to the uh, Italian Grand Prix in the F1 calendar. I believe this is one of the oldest races on the F1 calendar dating back of course to the 1950s. Now of course Monza has been around much longer. Uh, I think they've been around for nearly a hundred years now. I believe it's, it's certainly since the 1920s and this was very popular back in the pre-F1 era when it was just simply Grand Prix motor racing. Much more dangerous circuit back then, uh, of course, it included uh, an oval banking section, which of course no longer is part of the track. Uh, I don't think it's been part of the track, probably not since the 1960s at least. Um, but it's um, a very, very interesting and historic track with so many great races and tragedies over the years. Uh, not only on four wheels, but also on two wheels as well, because this was also a popular Grand Prix circuit on the motorbike calendar. And in recent years, it's been uh, host to the Monza Rally for the um, World Rally Championship as well. So we're just starting to get towards to the end of this warm-up lap. Okay, we're going past the uh, Ascari chicane now. We're in third gear, just under 100 kilometers an hour. We're racing on Pirelli P0 soft tires. So hopefully that will give us a little bit more in the way of um, grip than uh, a harder compound would. So we're still weaving about as we're heading towards the penultimate, in fact, the last corner on this track, which is the Parabolica Curve. So we're just making sure that we're keeping the brakes and the tires warm. So going up to fourth gear, 170 kilometers an hour, now breaking hard into Parabolica. There's a bit of a slide as we're coming out of there. And now we're getting ready for this one lap shootout. So the car, the car's performance is not as good as the um, RSO one because this is quite simply a road car rather than a sports car. So let's see how we get on in this one lap shootout around Monza. Here we go, here we go. Two, three, and we're away. That's a very good start. Making positions now. Already up into fifth gear, 190 kilometers an hour, getting ready to go towards the first chicane. We're now starting down, starting to break. Try not to. Oh, we just kissed the back end of that competitor there, and we're and we're just giving them a little love nudge as we're heading out of the first chicane. Already up into second gear. Fourth gear, and we're already starting to make some positions up into sixth position. Okay, and we're heading towards the chicane now, breaking down hard, down into first gear. 60 kilometers an hour, up into fourth position already. Get on the power now, we're heading towards the Lesmos. We're coming up to the first Lesmo now, and we're gonna dip on the brakes, keeping it in third gear, keeping it nice and steady on the, on the steering there, and we're already up into third position. 
Okay, coming into the second Lesmo. Down to second gear. Up into third gear. Fourth gear, and we're already up into second position. Okay, going down the hill under the bridge. We're, go we're going to get ready for the Ascari chicane. And we're going to start braking now. Braking down into third. Over revving a little bit. Coming into the chicane. Going a little bit wide there. Can we take the lead of this race before the end? Maybe, maybe not. We'll have to see. I think we've lost a little bit of performance there. Then the only opportunity is to get up to the Parabolica and see if we can snatch the lead there. So let's see what we can do. Okay. Just gently braking. Down into third. Into the Parabolica. Oh, that was a little bit wide, a bit too deep on the brakes. Can we get the lead? I don't think we can. It's going to get really, really close. No! Six tenths behind the winner of that race. I think if we weren't too deep on the brakes and... Was, was a little bit smoother into the Ascari chicane, I think we could have made something out of it. But hey, we got from 12th to 2nd. 10 places in one lap. That is absolutely incredible. So that's not a bad result. We'll take that. Okay, so that is the end of this one lap shootout around the Monza Grand Prix circuit. I certainly hope that you've enjoyed watching this as much as I have uh, racing here. And do you know what? In Project Cars 2, the game that we're playing, this is one of actually one of my favorite cars to drive. Uh, it's nice and sporty and also you can have a little bit of fun with it. It's, it's, it's not too unpredictable. Uh, it's, it, I'd say it's a balance between good sporting performance and also just having that kind of flair and style, especially if you're going round the corners. So what we'll do now is we'll let you see a replay of that race and you can have a look yourself from another angle as to how well I did. So quick reminder, I'm on social media, which is Matinee's Racing on TikTok, Telegram and Instagram. And of course, on Twitter at One Mats Racing. So don't forget to subscribe and click the bell notification icon to this channel so you don't miss any future videos. And we're gonna have a oh and we're gonna have another video for you next week. So take care, stay safe, whatever you're doing, and, and I'll talk to you next time. Take care. <laughs>